Hi everyone. My name is Jessica and I'm an education intern out here at Turpentine Creek. Welcome back to Tiger Tuesday. So today we're going to be talking about a medium-sized monkey called a rhesus macaque. If any of you guys have been out here to Turpentine Creek, you may have met our own rhesus macaque. His name is Goober. He is our oldest resident at 33 years old. And the wild rhesus macaques can live to be about the age of 25, although in captivity, with proper care, they can live much, much longer. Rhesus macaques are an old world monkey native to Asia. They actually boast the widest geographic range of any non-human primate species. This ranges all the way from Afghanistan all the way over to the coast of China. Because of this wide range, they are very adaptable monkeys. They are known to live in elevations as low as sea level, all the way up to 13,000 feet. There are also some introduced colonies of rhesus macaques that live here in the United States, specifically Florida and South Carolina. Florida's population of rhesus macaques came about in the 1930s, whenever six rhesus macaques were introduced to Florida's Silver Spring State Park. The rhesus macaques were put onto an island where they quickly swam away because rhesus macaques are excellent swimmers and they started populating in surrounding areas where they still live today. South Carolina's population of rhesus macaques came about in the 1970s whenever a sizable amount of them was brought over to Morgan's Island in South Carolina where they were studied for biomedical research. Puerto Rico also has a large colony of introduced rhesus macaques. They were also brought over in the 1930s. They have been studied in a free range colony ever since. Rhesus macaques are a medium sized monkey. The males can weigh upwards of 17 pounds, whereas the females are a little bit smaller and they can weigh upwards of 11 pounds. Rhesus macaques are omnivorous. In the wild, they have a diet that consists of roots, seed, insects, and fruits. Goober, our own rhesus macaque, he has a diet that consists of leafy greens, brown rice, peanuts, crickets, and so much more. He also loves his favorite treat, which happens to be grapes. In the wild, rhesus macaques live in groups of 100 or more. They are very social animals. Goober lives here at Turpentine Creek by himself. Because he does, we offer him a television. We give Goober this TV to keep him company throughout the day because we don't want Goober to ever feel like he's lonely. Goober loves cartoons. His favorite TV shows are Dora the Explorer and Curious George. Thank you so much for tuning in to this week's Tiger Tuesday. Please be sure to like and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more educational videos each week.